Make Miracles with Your Positive Spirit, Part 5 of 6 on Between Master and Disciples, given in English on January 2nd, 2006 in United Kingdom. You count it, you see, like you know, like we have 100 people here, and you have only 50 small vegan pies. Then you divide it half, half, okay? Half of the love is uh, better than nothing. <laughs> half of the love, <laughs> love. <laughs> okay, right, it's good? Yeah. Okay. Now I ask you a big favor. Uh, we have a break, okay? Are you hungry, some of you? No. Mm, tell me the truth. Hungry, right? Yes, yes. It's cold outside and it's been a long day. You eat, we come back later. But after you eat, you have to change, okay? Many of you, I mean, because we don't have room, so some of you have to go upstairs. So the upstairs people who sit in a loft, Himalaya loft, <laughs> can go down here, understand? Uh, some of them climb on the loft, you know? And some sit uh, in the bathroom, whatever, okay? So we change, all right? Happy to do that? Yes. Good. And I'll come back later, all right? And we'll be around, okay? Yes. I'll be around. Because here they arrange, I have a little room there, so I can also hide myself in the Himalaya in the cave <laughs> while you are doing your gymnastics. And then we see each other again, okay? And then we can meditate all that together, okay? Later. Not always a questioning, but meditate, okay? Right. See you soon. Ah, this is a good center, eh? Good center. See you later, guys. Thank you. I'll give you a chance later, okay? I'll give you a chance later. Thank you. Tell you what, you can touch my hand, that's my promise. <laughs> <laughs> that's a blessing as well. Blessing. Was it? Oh, thanks a lot. Mm, I always love it. Oh. Jokes again, wow. <laughs> nice. We have a lot of jokes. <laughs> Thank you. See you later. Thank you. Thank you. Whoever didn't have chance, we have it later, okay? So we don't make a mess in here, okay? We have chance. Hello. 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 Squeeze downstairs. Yeah, the you can go a little further. Slow, 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 slow. Not the camera, not in, in between. Okay, let's just keep like that, but keep coming, coming and going, <laughs> come and go, go and come. That's it. Okay, and other people upstairs can the the one the one here can go more up, and the it depends if you want. If not, uh, other people squeeze on corridor and everywhere. Okay. If any of you want to go down, you're welcome. If not, just stay up there. You're welcome also up there. <laughs> okay. If that kid huh, or any of the human beings just merely a physical body, you know, then it's not possible that he can think that way. You understand? There must be a soul behind it. There must be some driven force behind it, okay? Otherwise, an ordinary person under such a die circumstances, still can have such an upright spirit. And they're very proud, you know, they're not begging or anything like that. 
So the one of the mothers, you know, had a baby who was very ill, and she didn't have money. So she wanted to bring her, she wanted to walk like 20 miles to the next hospital in town, you know, in a bigger city, to beg them to help her somehow, if they would. So the journalist, by the way, you know, give her and her baby the lift to town. And then the journalist, uh, one of the journalists, or that journalist also gave her some money for the baby, for the treatment. And she was very stunned. The native Rwanda islander was very surprised. She looked at her very surprised and said, your lift was good enough. They're really good people, very proud, very honest, so that they deserve help. Anyway, I, I did some help. Just, just by the way, I tell you, yeah, normally I don't tell. Just this example, so that you know, yeah? If you just hold your positive spirit, miracles happen. Besides, even if you're so lousy and negative, <laughs> After you learn this quanning method, miracles still happen. <laughs> so can you imagine if you're more positive, huh? more faith, how more powerful can you be? Okay? You bless yourself, bless your life, bless the whole world, bless the universe. Make miracles happen everywhere, wherever you walk. Understand me? Yes. Do that. It will happen. Okay. That kid, he's only 16, and he talked like that. Yeah? The whole village doesn't talk to them and doesn't go near them because they're so poor. Say that they, they will uh, not you know, be very lucky or not good or anything. But then he said, I will prove them wrong. <laughs> Work 18 hours a day at 16 years old to, to, to nourish the five brothers and sisters and grandparents, old grandparents. And he, he says he's not afraid of anything. The only one he's afraid of is that he might get ill, That's it. so that he cannot work, you know? And meanwhile, still study something by himself, one book that he grabbed somewhere. And because of that spirit, miracles did happen. Only 30 pounds, you can buy a plot of land, plant vegetables, and be sufficient for the whole family already. 30 pounds only. Understand? So the money I send is, is more than a miracle. Yeah, more than 10 times that I send to him apart from sending for other people as well. So just a strong spirit like that, yeah? And it's not initiated, it's not anything spiritual, any special. It's just the one who concentrates on working to feed his family. And such a strong power like that could make miracles happen. <laughs> it is a miracle for him. The whole family needs only 30 pounds to be independent forever. And he has more than that. You know, for that country, for that situation, it's like a big fortune, like you would win like 100,000 pounds all of a sudden, and all you needed was just like maybe 10,000 pounds. So that's, that is a miracle, okay? It's a manifestation of a miracle. And the boy, he earned it because of what he said, because of the, 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 the spirit of positivity in him, because of the sacrifice he made for his family, and so positive and so, still so strong. That can make miracles happen. Hmm? So, how much more could you make, you see, in your lucky situation and the spiritual power that you've been given to and acquired and continue to develop so we can make anything happen with your mind power? Just think good for others, yeah? Do good to others. And that's a miracle that you're making every day. You are the miracles. Okay? You are the miracles for other people, for yourselves, for the less fortunate. That's what heaven is made of. What else do you think is heaven to that boy, 16 years old? Hmm? When he got more than 10 times what he needed for the whole family forever, what, what, else, what else do you think heaven would look like? Hmm? <laughs> what else do you think a miracle is? So we make miracles every time. Mm? We make it with our hands, because we earn money, and then with that hand we can give life, sustain and power to some unfortunate people. Mm? We comfort them with our thoughts, with our speech, with our loving kindness. These are all miracles that you're making every day, and I'm proud of you that you're doing that. Anytime somebody needs you, you give, okay?
Surprisingly, in our societies, there are still some people who need us, not just in Africa. Yeah? So we have a chance to do that every day. Maybe just uh, 50 cents to a homeless for a warm tea, maybe one pound for someone else, yeah, who is sick and couldn't work, something like that. Maybe just a cup of coffee for the neighbor when she couldn't get out. Maybe buy her some medicine when she needs to go to for the pharmacy and she can't, yeah? Maybe just any little things, okay? Because those are miracles. To some people who cannot get it, it's a miracle. Just like you, when you want to come here and you cannot, and when you can, you say, oh, it's a miracle. <laughs> yes, miracles happen all the time. Miracles depend on what you need. Yeah? Do you? A miracle is just to go and see some strange woman. <laughs> Don't earn any money or have any, nothing. Or maybe a big mince pie, that's it. <laughs> That's a miracle, <laughs> big deal miracle, not just a small miracle to you, see? <laughs> but to that boy in Rwanda, yeah? a 30 pounds gift is a big miracle, and even more than that, 10 times, more than 10 times, 12 times bigger, the amount he needs for the whole family, forever, at least for life, you know, to build the whole strong life. Maybe we open a business with that as well, <laughs> a big farm or something, <laughs> yeah and uh, be able to send his brothers and sisters to school, yeah? And uh, medicaid his old parents, grandparents, thing like that, you know? Or help other people later when he becomes rich. It will go on forever. It's not just him. Because somebody help him now, later he will help someone else. That is always for sure. He will never forget. He will never forget the day that he needs it. And then he will understand the people who need it. Yeah? He will not forget. Yeah, a person like that will not forget. So it's not like I'm just helping him or his family, you know? It will continue. The kindness will be breeding more kindness, and many people will benefit from that. And this is a good way. This, this is how we live our lives, yeah? We breed kindness. We nurture it, and make it grow and spread all over the world. And that's how the world becomes better. It does affect in many ways, not just spiritual way, but physical way as well. The things that you don't know. It affects the government, it affects the leaders, it affects the peace, it affects everything. You see now, so more and more people are vegan. Yeah? And the war in Ireland is finished. South Korea, North Korea talked. <laughs> For example, you know, many things I uh, cannot uh, even. Uh, I remember sometimes. And even the, the king of Japan, the emperor of Japan, just read a loving letter, like a sympathetic letter to the whole world, um, saying how sorry and how sympathetic he feels to the victims of the wars. He never did that before. Maybe you think it's because of economy uh, pressure or political pressure, but it has always been, <laughs> you know? <laughs> it's not the first time that any nation has any pressure from anyone else or any other country or from international power. It's not the first time the Japanese has that or any other country has that. It's getting better all the time. Of course, it's still cleaning, <laughs> cleaning of the astral. <laughs> but uh, the rest will be fine and strong and get better all the time. Look at how far we have lived in all aspects. The disaster well, cannot help. That is the karma of the astral energy. But otherwise, whatever improvement, it just gets better and better all the time. Can you imagine before what you have now? Talking to a piece of square like that, hello, and then <laughs> the guy from the other end of the universe answers you. <laughs> and many other things. And you can uh, concentrate 1,000 songs in that small iPod. <laughs> Nobody knows where it comes from, so small. Huh? 300 songs, it's just a small stick like that, like a chewing gum. Yeah, see, powerful, powerful thing. <laughs> Nowadays, we can't even see each other from a 100,000 miles away just by holding a square thing in your hand. Huh? <laughs> a video, picture, everything, songs, DVD, you know, the person at the other end of the globe, 
can see it like right in front of you. Just right in your hand only. That would be a miracle, <laughs> hundred years ago, or maybe even seventy, fifty years ago, right? Yes. Life is a miracle all the time. If you look, you see miracles. Yeah. Just sometimes we take it for granted. Yeah, and wishing, watching for something else, which is is not really important or not necessary at all. Yeah. Miracle is I'll... in your hand. If you go out work with it, miracle is in here. If you go out work with it, you bring home miracles. And you can spread that miracle all around you and around the globe. We have miracle all the time. The whole body is a miracle. Just make use of it and make more miracles. Understand? If you don't use it, it's not much miracle, except you can see. It's good already. Don't wait until you're blind and think, my God, I had a miracle before. <laughs> Appreciate it. Every day, thank God. Yeah, thank the universe for the sustaining power so that the, the whole planet doesn't drop into somewhere, so that the sun even stays in the sky, so that the moon even comes out, say hello to you every month, on time. <laughs> no clock needed. Miracles are everywhere. Huh? Mm-hmm. 